Alrighty everybody, so for this giveaway we had about 8,500 comments. Um, so that was a huge turnout. That was by far my biggest turnout that I've had so far for a giveaway. And that's going to make me want to do more giveaways for you guys. I have a lot more cases that I'm going to be giving away. Um, it's going to still be opened up to the world. In fact, the winner of this giveaway today is not from the US. Um, so you guys know it's going to be open up to the world. It's open up to all my subscribers now So definitely make sure you stay subscribed from all my future giveaways and updates that I'll be doing But uh, for the actual giveaway that we were just hosting for the Cena Milano flip casing that is going to go to I have it written down on my phone Let me go through the winner of this Cena Milano flip casing is going to be called Jonesy's K8 Jones YSK8. I will be messaging you on YouTube. Uh, if you have 48 hours to actually respond to me, we'll just give you 48 hours. Uh, if you don't respond within 48 hours, we're going to be reopening up the giveaway and I will be giving it away to a second person. I'll be giving it away to a new person, so make sure you respond immediately with your address so I'll actually be able to ship it out to you. You are somewhere in Canada. I don't know, I'm not going to just ship it to Canada, so give me an address for the Cena Milano flip casing. Thank you everybody for actually subscribing and participating in the giveaway. It was fantastic. Amazing turnout. We got to the top part of the leaderboards for YouTube. But anyway, if you didn't win, dot, 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 stay tuned because I got an application review for you guys coming up in just a few seconds. So thank you for all the participation. I will talk to you later. Have a fantastic day. Alrighty everybody, and now we actually have the review portion of this video. We're going to start it off with a very popular one right now called Wild West Pinball. This is surprisingly free. Uh, it is by far one of the best free applications that I've seen so far in the App Store. It has online leaderboards, fantastic gameplay, amazing graphics, pretty much superb content overall. There's no reason you would not want to go out and get this application. So when you start it up, just as you would a pinball machine, flick back and you're off. So as you see already it's amazing graphics, no frame rate issues for so much on a screen at a, little, at a time um, but when you go here controls are extremely simplistic. Flicking the right side of the screen anywhere we'll do the right paddle and same with the left side of the screen. So that's pretty much your entire set of controls right there left paddle and right paddle which is great because it makes for a simple yet amazingly addicting application. So as you see here you've got a lot of different things that actually happen on this pinball machine. Uh, you have all the bumpers that you normally would. It's pretty much a generic pinball layout. You have the bumpers, you have some sort of a conveyor that can actually take you somewhere else. There's a little pocket where you can go to. There's even a mini game which I have not yet been able to master. As you see right here, wow it's pretty crazy that we got in here. Uh, I don't know how to do it. You're supposed to hit that guy that comes out, Dirty Harry. I don't know how to actually hit it because there are no instructions included with this application. Uh, but other than that, I recommend going to get it immediately. I don't want you guys to have to wait and then it become a paid application. They're offering it as free right now. It's a fantastic deal. It's one of my favorite applications. I would definitely pay some money for this, but if you can get it while it's free, why not? Who would be complaining about this? This is going to be called Wild West Pinball, a free application from the App Store. Alrighty guys, and my next app that I have for you guys is going to be called Best Buy Gamers Club. I've already reviewed a Best Buy application called Best Buy Weekly Deals, and this is pretty similar, but its layout for the application is much better. Um, it's also more focused towards gamers overall. Uh, it's got every type of game console you could really imagine as of right now. But anyway, we're going to start from our main menu, from our main home page. And up at the top, you have your HUD with search for, which can also be seen right here for shopping. So you can find a specific um, item that you're looking for. Up in the right corner, you can search and narrow down and target a certain location where you want to actually find stores for Best Buy. These middle two tabs, weekly deals, and my shopping list, when you actually open up this application, you can make an account very easily. It only need your name and zip code, just a few things actually. And then you'll be able to start tagging different items to actually make a shopping list to save onto your device. And then also weekly deals, if you want to click on this, it'll bring you into a separate page showing you weekly deals and when they expire. It's a fantastic design here because when you open it up, It'll bring you into a completely new tab with amazing detail with more info, reviews, ratings, prices, all the things that you would want to be able to find in store or online brought into such a small little application. So go back, we'll go back to our actual home page where we just were, and now we have our bottom HUD. You have home gamers, which we'll go to next, and if you're a gamer, obviously some of you guys out there are gamers, you have the, the six main consoles for right now, Xbox 360, PS3, Wii, PSP, 
Nintendo DS, and PC. So I only have a PS3 that I'm actually looking for right now, so you can narrow it down to any type of uh, genres that you want or consoles that you want, go back, and you can actually find special offers for the selected choices of consoles that you actually chose. Um, so special offers, top games, and new and pre-releases. So let's just say that we wanted to go into special offers for PS3. It'll load up in a few, uh, few seconds, and here we go. So for PS3, what can we do? Sony PlayStation 80 gigabyte. What is the deal for an 80 gigabyte PS3 right now? We'll click it and it'll bring up a tab. Hmm. $400. That's the deal, I guess. Not sure what their deal is that they're trying to actually convey here. Apparently it's $400. I don't know if that's on sale or what, but they're trying to say that it is actually going to be $400. That's a special offer for an 80 gig PS3. Um, so anyway, that's going to be the gamer section of this, app or this application. That's pretty much the main section that you're going to be looking through. List, this is your shopping list that you've actually created that I was speaking about earlier. We don't have anything saved yet though. Go under stores, and you can actually find a store near you. Or if you want to go into more, this is where we had the weekly deals. And there's also some more tabs. Deals, like that we were just talking about personalize so if you want to actually start your account that's how you're going to do it takes a few seconds very easy very simple to do terms of use privacy policy and help so you really don't need any of those and that's going to be the entire application it's basically best buy weekly deals the application that I previously released uh, or previously reviewed um, but a lot better the layout is fantastic on this application they did a great job uh, you can find stuff way better on this so we'll actually just search something we'll try Sony Oh, handy cam, and we'll search it, and in just a few seconds it should bring us all the results for Sony Handycams. Hopefully, I know it's looking for them. Alrighty, and there we go. This has all the results that we can find for Sony Handycam camcorders. Uh, it's very simple. This is pretty much the entire Best Buy site brought to you the tip to your fingers on just a small little application. It is free. I recommend going to check it out. It's not just for gamers, but it is supposed to be designed for gamers. But even if you're not a gaming person, definitely go check out the application if you're ever wanting to go to Best Buy to buy anything. That's the application you're going to want. Best Buy Gamers Club, a free application from the App Store. And my final one is one of the most frustrating yet addicting games that I've ever seen to hit an iPod or iPhone. It's going to be called Stroop. And I'm sure some of you have seen this type of gameplay, but what you do here is that it will show you a tab that you need to hit. There's three different colors um, from this main start, and what they are is red, green, and blue. So we'll show you right here an example. We'll start on level one. And here we go, touch the ball that matches the word. So it's called blue, but it was written in green. So this one is blue, but it's written in green. Blue, blue, green, green, red, green, green, green. So you get the idea. It's pretty much just written in a different color, and that is meant to completely mess with your eyes. And it it really does, especially when you're trying to actually get a really high score, quick timing. Uh, there is online leaderboards, which is really cool about it, so you always want to try and get the best high score possible. Um, I don't know why I closed the application. So you always want to try and get the best high score possible, but having to constantly figure out if you want to hit the color or the word itself can be a pretty big nail biter. It's really annoying at parts, but not in a bad way. It's more of a competitive, fun way. Uh, it can get frustrating though, but I definitely recommend to go check it out. Hopefully they'll release a light version with one or two levels in it because not a lot of you can see how addicting this actually is, but once you actually play it and you maybe are off by your high score by one or two seconds, you definitely want to keep trying to actually see if you can beat your new high score or if you can beat online leaderboards. So that's going to be called Stroop. I believe it's 99 cents in the App Store. Uh, check in the annotations up here. If not, go check it out. I recommend looking at it. It's a fantastic application. These are all really good ones. Um, I had about six or seven that I was going to be reviewing for you guys, but I ended up deleting them. They really weren't that high quality of applications. I don't want to be filling this with junk applications, but I'm trying to get the best ones out there for you guys. These are by far my three favorite that I found for this application review. Uh, I'll run through one more time. Wild West Pinball. Go check it out as soon as possible. Uh, next one was Best Buy Gamers Club. That is pretty much Best Buy completely in one small application. And then Stroop. The only actual game that I had in here for you guys That's a, that was kind of more puzzle addicting that you want to keep on playing uh, so that's going to be called Stroop I believe it's 99 cents or $1.99 uh, anyway go check it out in the app store hopefully you guys enjoyed this review I will talk to you later have a fantastic day hey guys do you want a full list of every app that I've ever reviewed starting from app review number one
go to my YouTube homepage and click the link under full list of applications. It'll give you a Word document including the title of an application, the pricing, and the rating. Hopefully this helps. I'll talk to you guys later.